The abduction and murder of three judges and a retired army major of the Ghana Armed Forces some 36 years ago continues to remain a blot on Ghana's history. The dark chapter occurred during the rule of then chairman of the PNDC, Jerry John Rawlings, and each year members of the judiciary and the Ghana Bar Association mark the occasion. Though the soldiers who executed the judges and the major are known, the masterminds of the brutal act are yet to be identified. The justices were Fred Pokusa Kodia, Cecilia Kranting Ado, and Kojo Ejei Ejeponghwaza Major was Sam Aqua. On special assignment this month, Johnny brings you Crimes That Shook the Nation. In the first episode of the two-part series, we go back in history and ask who killed the judges. Here are excerpts. Ike Captain Kujo Chikata G. Monife Nofeno. Ijaake. Leji Unupa. Niko. National Chief Security no. Ife Isha. Yehua. Ming Pabufai. Esa ni mafe nakai. Noni ake mea fele. This account is endorsed by the NRC as it insists that, without official backing, Amata Kwe had neither the capacity nor the means to commit such a heinous crime. The observed behavior of Amedeka at the prisons also confirms that he knew that the oppression was authorized by those who wielded power at the time. It's obvious an operational pass was given for a vehicle carrying at least three superior court judges, which meandered through almost 50 kilometers journey from their residence at Ridge to Bundase near Afinya. Well, the head of security then, Captain Chikata, agrees that the men indeed abducted the judges and had some form of clearance, even though he couldn't say who authorized it. The operational pass is issued from the operations department of PNDC headquarters. And it is normally issued by the, office, the operations officer or his deputy or the officer who will be on duty if there is an emergency. Those are the only people who can issue the operational pass. The operational pass would have been issued by the officer, the operations officer in PNDC HQ. If you see the pass, you will see his signature on it. The officer must sign the pass. The official sequence of events from the NRC asked that at a hastily summoned meeting at Gonda Barracks, at which Captain Chikata and Chachu Chikata were present, Rollins sent for Amata Kwe, whom they all knew had carried out the abduction. According to then Attorney General George Akins, Amata Kwe was sent for, and when he came and was told to go and release the captives, he responded that they had finished them, meaning they had killed them. The commission further made this declaration. If Flight Lieutenant Rollins did not have foreknowledge of the murders, he certainly had foreknowledge of the abductions. When the commission confronted Flight Lieutenant Rollins with Justice Akin's statement on the meeting at Gonda Barracks, he turned to his mentor, Chachuchikata, to get him out.